Hello everyone. So first of all, I am trying out like a different type of filming background. Um, so let me know what you guys think about that. Secondly, uh, for the end of 2018, I wanted to go over a few of my collections. So this video is going to be purely my photo cards uh, at the end of 2018. The second video that I'll post soon after is going to just be like an overall of my entire collection um, at the end of 2018. And these videos are mostly just for me to see how my collection has grown over the next year. So at the end of 2019, we'll see if I will make a new video. You can see that this is my Promise 9 binder and this is my 17 binder. This one is pretty small um, and it doesn't have a lot in it because I haven't figured out exactly what I'm going to collect from 17. So we will start with Promise 9 first of all. As you all know, they are my old girl group. Sorry if you can hear my bird chirping in the background. Uh, this was as quiet as I could get the house to be. <laughs> so this is the cover. Uh, my very first video was a binder like create my binder with me. Um, so this is kind of an update to see how it has grown over the past few months. So let's open it. So the very first page, as you can see, um, I have a few little uh, pockets on the side of just things that I keep. So these are the cat stickers, like the leftover ones from the beginning. These I keep in here for like trades. I like to use these to close the envelopes. So, and they're just cute overall, so I keep them in there. And then mostly I have um, a lot of these plastic sleeves from trades and purchases. So I keep these just in case I need them. And then I have stamps, of course, uh, for trades and stuff like that. Uh, let's see. So this is just a photo card that I already have, so I need to trade it, but no one wants to trade for it. So, and let's see what else. So I have a free, few freebies um, that you can see. As well, I do have, if I can get them out, I have just these little um, sticky note pads that I use for my binder to let me know what I need and what I already have coming in. So that's the front pocket. So then the very first page is From Us Nine's To Heart, uh, the Polaroid versions from the Blue Album. So overall, I don't collect the name tags. I do collect all of the photo cards though, and I still need three. So if anyone wants to trade the extra Jihun that I have, go ahead and let me know. So this is as far as I have gotten in 2018. Also, in my very first photo card binder um, like video, I was using construction paper as a background, but a commenter let me know that that was really unsafe and that the construction paper could bleed. So I found these little Ultra Pro, um, I believe that's the brand. They're like supposed to be used for like Pokemon cards, but I use them for the photo cards. Oh, I think my tripod is wiggling. Sorry if I... I think I hit it. Second page is um, the two heart uh, ID pictures. This one is very much a work in progress. Um, so obviously, as you could tell, I have sticky notes showing what I need, what I have. But so far, I do just have Jisun, Hyung, and Jiwon's. I really need to work on this, so we will see what happens in the coming year. This is actually just my special page of um, just overall more special photo cards um, and just random stuff. So I have a few from this uh, group version is the Kino album group card, but obviously I couldn't fit it since they're nine pocket sleeves. So it goes on this page. These two are KCON uh, LA and New York photo cards. Um, that I purchased because they are technically kind of official photo cards. So I wanted to have those. 
So obviously you guys have seen these in my last haul. These are the Promise Event photo cards from today. These are just the three that I currently have. And then um, this one is a fan sign photo card and then broadcast or vice versa. I don't exactly remember. Um, and these are so, so, so special to me. This one's actually going to be coming up in a haul, but it is my Jihan Polaroid. This is very pre-debut, uh, and it did cost a lot of money, but I am very glad that I have it in my collection. And then this one is my Polaroid with them. I don't think I've shown this on here, but this is my Polaroid that I took with them at KCON LA. So I keep these in here. Eventually I am going to, um, get like a frame for them when I get my new bookshelf. So this is like my overall amazing page that I love so much. <laughs> this page probably costs more than um, my textbooks for college. So let's just talk about that. The next next page is the start of today. These are my full sets. Uh, unfortunately, of course, Guri was not in this comeback. So this is about as full as it will get. These are the, um, I believe the D minus one versions. Yes, D minus one. This is the full set. Um, I'll actually link below the eBay seller that I bought most of these off. So I do actually have, um, like little indicators of what I pulled in my personal albums, which are these little firework stickers that you see on Jihan and Chaeyoung. I like to do that for every album that I purchase from Promise, just to show what I have pulled and what I have bought, which are all the rest. The next one is obviously D-Day. Also, um, as I didn't mention before, I do just collect the bookmarks, um, but we'll see what happens in the next year. Who knows if I'll start collecting them. So this page is the D-Day versions. These are probably my favorite from Miss Photo Cards. Uh, they're just really, really cute. I love all the flowers and their outfits. So the very next page, this is where things go downhill. So these are my Love Bomb, my From Nine photo card collections. As you can tell, I don't have a lot because my friend, um, has not sent me my fan sign uh, items yet. Hopefully in January we'll be able to get those, but those do have most of the photo cards that I am missing um, along with my fan sign pages. But what I do have currently is Jihan and Soyeon. I did purchase this one and I did pull this one. I was supposed to have a serum coming from a trade, but I don't know. But these are just the two that I currently have. And then, as well as this page, I'm missing plenty, as you can tell. But um, I do just have Jiwon and Hayoung. So, that is all that I have for Love Bomb at the current moment. Hopefully in January, I'll be able to get all the cards that I am missing. And then the next page is, of course, the Kino album photo cards. These photo cards are super, super nice. They are like cardstock, I would say. They're kind of like a thicker photo card. Um, so these are really nice. And then these are just like the invitations I currently own when I get my fan sign albums. Um, then I will most likely have a full set of the invitations, but currently I just have Jihan, Gyori, and um, Soyeon. So those are the only ones that I currently have. And the rest of the pages are just blank and ready for new comebacks from Promise 9. And then the back page does have one of my mini posters, but that is um, as far as my Promise 9 binder has gotten. So the next one we are going to talk about is just my little uh, 17 photo card binder. As of 2018, I don't really know exactly what I am going to collect from them. I do probably want to just collect my ults, which are Jonghan and June. 
So we'll see how this collection turns out in 2019. But this is my little pho photo card binder that I did get from applying for the third generation carrot. As you can see, it is Rose Quartz and Serenity. Super adorable, I love it. Oh, and then on the side it says, say the name. On the back it says, oh yes, I'm that diamond, inimitable 17 carat. So let's go ahead and open this up. So the very first things I have are just photo cards that don't fit in here. So I do have my um, photo card that I purchased from the Ideal Cut in Japan. I did purchase it obviously because they are my two ults. So that is one that I have. These two um, are photo cards that I pulled in my albums. They are the lenticular photo cards from Director's Cut. So I pulled Hoshi and then I did pull Wanu. So yes, those are two that I pulled. And currently I just have all of the photo cards that I pulled or purchased um, from special events. So obviously these two are from my two alone versions. Um, I don't have the third version, so we'll see where that goes. And then this is just going 17. I just have one version of that album. These are all four of my teenage versions. So these are my director's cut. And then it starts my little uh, You Make My Day album uh, collections. I do have five of those albums. So I have um, two from, I don't, I don't remember what version this is. These ones are yellow, so these are the yellow version ones. So these ones are from Meat. I couldn't remember for a second. These are from... These are also from Meat. I have two versions of Meat. And then um, these are from Set the Sun, and then Set the Sun, and then Follow. And then... That's it for the You Make My Day. These are just like random photo cards I had nowhere else to put. So this is my Japanese debut photo card. And then this one is another photo card that I purchased. It was Jonghan and June. So I figured I had to have it. And it is from Carrotland, uh, 2017, I believe. Yeah. And then this is the only June card that I have pulled from Love and Letter. And that's actually my entire 17 collection. Um, so the rest are just blank. I do actually keep my KCON uh, 2018 ticket in here since they gave us some ticket sleeves because this is the day that I saw 17 live. So I like to keep that in here. And then I keep like the little styrofoam thing just to like keep the binders shape. But other than that, that is literally my entire 17 collection. Well, that's actually my entire photo card binder collection. In 2019, I would like to purchase some more 17 photo cards obviously when they have their next comeback I'm gonna purchase hella uh I'm probably I haven't decided yet but I'm probably gonna start collecting Jonghan and June just because I feel like I need to <laughs> I don't know how far back I will go to fo collect for them but I still have some albums that I need to purchase from them and then obviously from S9, I would like to co continue collecting OT9 and finish these two. Um, and then collect Jihan's like special photo cards. So broadcast cards, fan sign photo cards, if I can find them for a decent price. So thank you guys for watching. Um, we'll see how my collection grows in 2019. I don't know how to end this video. So bye guys. This has been my photo card collection.